like share comment and subscribe and remember hit that bell notification so that you get notified for each and every video i upload what's up guys today i am going to show you the basics of making a simulator in roblox studio so first what you want to do is i imported this random terrain from here the toolbox if you don't see this toolbox is like this you press the toolbox icon in home and it'll pop up uh, let's make this go down a bit so we can see more of the view so i uh, did this one terrain for base plate all you do is type in terrain just like this even though i spelled it i a now thinking about it and uh, now seeing it um so this is like the base plate this is the default for making the simulator and i'm gonna um right now create a spawn you need to spawn we have the spawn let's uh, leave the spawn like that just like that so now what we're going to do is we're just going to leave the spawn like that we are now going to add in service script service a script and that script is called let's rename this to leader stats all under case uh lower case even so the first script for this is game dot players if you want to make a simulator um it's game dot players dot player added colon connect connect function and then it's like this and then it's then it is player then this one is local dot oh we're not not local dot it's local stats local stats equals instance instance dot new uh, brackets colon folder so that is that one. Oh no wait wait we're not done yet i thought we were done but we were not done yet so stats equal stop stats dot new equals the leader stats and then this is stats dot parent equals the player so that's the first one done we can well we're not going to copy and paste this one actually but the second one is basically the same so it's local dot or local strength even we're doing a weight lifting simulator by the way so um instance dot new all right instance dot new int value then it is strength strength dot name oh wait that says new um it's not new it's name actually strength dot name equals strength dot name equal strength like that and it's capitals like that so then it is strength dot value equals zero and then the strength strength dot parent equals stats then right geez okay then it is local cash equals instance dot new instance dot new and then it's int value again value okay there we go cash dot 
name equals cash dot name equals the cash just call it cash so and then it's oh and then it's cash cash dot cash dot value equals zero again and then it's cash dot parent parent equals stats uh, so there it is so these are all uppercase or are they all uppercase I don't think they're all uppercase actually okay so that's that that is the the um, stats the strength <coughs> oh my god and all that other stuff so now if we play this we will find strength and cash next to our name so now that we play it it says S and an eight, or that's my name, whatever your name is. Strength zero, cash zero. Normally it wouldn't have this at all, it just say players, then the list of players. But this time it says strength zero, cash zero. So whenever we click, it will go up, like you know, it will go up in strength. And then we can buy stuff, or well, not buy stuff, we can s sell our weights to get cash so now we have done that script we now need to make a main event in the workspace so now we got we are going to do that so let's add a script all right and then we are going to name the script main event uh, a normal script as well you could say so this is the script it is script dot add strength oh wait 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 we're not done we're not done yet i was uh, going to do a remote event and then what are we what we're gonna do what we're gonna call the remote event is we're gonna call it add oh add strength because i was about to say add strength and it wouldn't work without the remote thingy script dot add strength right here add strength is it a bit too for a uh, bit big for you there we go on server event that's the only one there connect there we go connect function and then it's the brackets and then it is player then it is player dot leader stats all right dot strength dot value dot uh well not dot keep putting a lot of dots so and then it's player dot lead oh wait no player dot lead the stats dot strength and that is the script so now if we play the game it should the main event it should value go up it should do that oh wait we're not done we're not done yet we're not done yet my mistake i remembered i remembered value plus one so that means whenever we click it will go up one in value and you will see that but we need something to click with 
because this won't actually work this main event we need to find a model and we call it wait click the first one this one this one's pretty popular oh just click now if that pops up just say no if you said yes it would have um it would have now actually put it in there all so remove the local script in it if there's a local script in yours this one's popular mostly popular delete the local script we don't need any local scripts um mesh make the scale yeah the scale 0.5 dash 0.5 dash 0.5 now it's a bit bigger uh, you don't really need to do that i just want to do that myself now you want to add a well if you go on it if you click it it will it, because it says mesh and touch interest right here let's play the game and see if it works so now we are going to play the game right now it's on the floor all this stuff it should work with the um the script that we added so if we click press this oh geez what the hell happened this is the this is why we have to um do we have to test games because they really don't work yeah they have what have they done okay hmm all right let's see uh let's put this up a bit because that is just too big geez okay let's um see if this works now oh it fell on the floor oh there we go now it works so it's supposed to pick it up and you're supposed to be holding it like this but oh it doesn't work Hmm. let's see um. hmm doesn't work well touch interest the mesh hmm main event let's see it is completely correct this is completely correct by the way hmm that is correct i think we need to add a local script this is a local script yes for the tool and it's a local script it is script dot parent dot activated oh, activated connect connect function right there function leave that there's nothing to put there at all game dot workspace make that capital or else it probably won't work game dot workspace dot main event dot add strength and then it's fire server leave it like that and don't need to put anything else in there then it is script dot parent dot enable enabled equals false then it is wait plus one uh, actually it's not plus one it's just one and then it is script dot parent dot enabled 
equals true. That is the um, that is the local script. <sighs> so this is the local script. So let's name this local script add strength right here. It's going to be the same as this remote event. Now if we play it, it should hopefully work. Jeez, I've been having a lot of troubles today already. <sighs> let's see. Hopefully it works. Yes, it works, as you can see. Number four and cash. Yeah, now we have 40 strength. But we need something to, s we need to sell something. Well, unfortunately, we will have to do that next, um, next time we record, I record a video, probably tomorrow. So, this is basically it. Oh, wait, no, this isn't it. You need to put this into starter. Oh, starter. Oh, come on now. Oh, no, it's now gonna. Uh oh. Hmm. Oh, no. Uh, wait, wait, wait. We have a possibility. No, we don't. N no, we really don't. Um, maybe we can group this together again. Hmm. Uh-oh. Copy that, actually, now I think about it. Copy that and put it in the start pack. Yes, there we go. Okay, we can delete this. So now it is in the starter pack. Because now, instead of picking it up, it will be in our inventory in the first place. There we go. So we don't need to pick anything up and then the next person doesn't have to pick uh can't pick another way to know all that stuff it's already in your starter pack when you join the game so now we are not done yet oh no we are done yet we are done ah so this is this is it for the um weight lifting simulator for today so I hope you've enjoyed this video and uh, I will see you all next time. Goodbye.